no, no, no. We're not doing this right now. How the hell do you have five devices out right now and expect me to believe you that you're actually doing I'm it? I'm actually being productive. Look at me. I'm editing right now. You're not even you're listening to person. yourself speak in the um, video. I'm what? watching my what are you doing? for inspiration. I'm all fucking doing nah. lingo, learning French. Yeah, yeah, pas les français. No. What are you talking no. about? No, no, no. We need to go a whole day without all this because I'm getting no, stressed no, just looking at you're you. Not. You're not. I don't think you can do it, but I want you to Okay, do you think I can do so, it? So, just give me it. Just give I obviously can't. You think? Okay, okay fine, fine. Here you go. Here you go. Okay, thank you. It's fine. Thank you very much. I'm throwing it away. I really thought I was just gonna put it in there with nothing. Pfft, hell not. I have my freaking shirt and a towel there. This was actually for school project, so enjoy. Normally the first thing I do when I wake up is check my phone to see what time it is and what messages I might have gotten throughout the night. However, my phone is dead and that is very intentional because I had a feeling that that would happen. The only way I could figure out what time it was was through a watch that Gio gave me. All I did this morning was feed my cat and write a little bit in my journal about what I could do today. I'm also doing this all while sick. Yeah. It's not going to be that fun. Although I can't actually use my laptop to edit, I can, however, look at the videos that are already on this camera's SD card and just go through them and write some notes so that I can help myself when I do end up editing. Smart ideas, right? Where are we going? You're going to mass? Going to mass. We just finished mass and now we're going to go get food. We're going to go to this Tup Tim Thai restaurant. Or Tim Tup Thai. Tim Yum Thai. I don't know. Tip Tip Tubby. So far, I feel fine because, uh, to be honest, I slept through the first half of the day and then I just went to Mass where you wouldn't use your phone anyway. But I was thinking of things where I'm just like, I should search this up. I can't search it up right now. So hopefully, I just remember what I want to search up. Like, I want to find a roller skating rink. Like, someplace where I can practice rollerblading. Little things like that. Oh my god, maybe I should search up this, maybe I should search up that, and I can't. But that's fine. Do I look like him? <laughs> what? You did, you did the... Perfect. <laughs> is, that, is that three people on a scooter? That's three people on a scooter. That's three people on a scooter! I remember, was it a while ago we were talking about? <laughs> My soul, your ultraviolet. Whee! I was surprised. I would probably rate it an eight and a half. Eight and a half out of ten. Okay. I would rate mine. I would say six and a half, or maybe like close to a seven. However, the rice, the rice didn't melt in my mouth. That's what I love. Same with the sticky rice and mango. The rice needed to melt in my mouth. What I, <laughs> I realized is that now that Gio's driving me or whatever, I would just probably be on my phone right now. Honestly, like I would be talking to you, yeah. but I would still be like on Instagram or something. It's interesting to see what you feel, I don't want to call it dead time, but would you feel little things like that? With? Yeah, like what do I do? I have like a whole list of the things that I want to do today so I don't get like bored. But I feel like boredom isn't always meant to be a bad thing and we're just so accustomed to being bored, like to feeling something, mm -hmm. feeling that boredom. But sometimes boredom sparks creativity. It's more, like it makes you do things. But it's so much easier for me to like go on YouTube or to go on Netflix. And I'm just like, let me find something to watch. Let me annoy one of my friends, which happens a lot. But I'm like, which friend would answer right now? And who can I annoy? Typically it's you. But yeah. when you're busy, I'm like, oh my God, I got to reach out to someone else. And you got to go to my secondary app. Oh my God. <laughs> it's now time for me to do laundry. <laughs> also going to clean this comforter or whatever. It's already four o'clock. I feel fine, honestly, because I took a nap after eating. <laughs> I've just been sleeping a lot today, which I guess helps pass time. And now I'm gonna spend my time cleaning, because I normally listen to podcasts and music while I'm cleaning. But I'll try my best to keep my, my brain entertained. Or not, and just let myself be null. My whole place is a mess, honestly. It's pretty bad, I'll show you. But it's been like this because I'm sick, because I didn't feel like doing anything. And honestly, just because I'm in college, I don't care. <laughs> this is the mess that we're working with. <laughs> Items here, not sure. My towels have fallen. My pants from today, because I wanted to wear my boxers. This freaking litter box. Okay, that litter, I used that brand over there. 
I will never use that brand again. That's why there's a new litter box because this thing clumps up so much. That's pee. That's not poop. That's pee. Sorry, it's a little bit disgusting. Whatever. A little bit bad. Not as bad. You see, like this is pretty good. So I did laundry the other day. My bed because I just changed it, and then my bag of used tissues and a bunch of my drugs that I've been taking for different reasons. Oh my god, my car. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> so I'm gonna clean up now and then figure the rest out later. I'm gonna have to go outside to try and scrape off the rest of this. Don't look at her being, that's weird. Here's something else I forgot to show you. I have here my actual trash bag, like the big one, and then it's like a regular Walmart bag because I was too lazy to take out the big trash. There's some things I realize I use electronic media, like my phone especially for, that I guess I don't really need to, but it makes me not have certain things i guess i don't have a tv because i use my laptop my ipad and my phone for that i don't have a clock in this place not even my microwave has the time on it i have no clock no way of telling time aside from that and that's why my, my boyfriend gave me a watch so i could at least be able to tell time like right now the the clothes are being washed with a 48 minute timer how am i supposed to know if i didn't have this watch now i do have an hourglass that i bought but i wouldn't turn the hourglass every minute like that's just that seems like overkill to try and track time. I love my camera. You know how like some characters in TV shows have parrots and stuff? I have a cat. And like most people with a cat in car in TVs and stuff, they're like petting it. No, like, she's she's acting like a bird. <laughs> I should not attempt to take her on a walk. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Won't necessarily be filming it because I don't want you guys to see where I live around, but yeah. <laughs> on a walk was rather successful what do you think uh, i mean i don't know <laughs> it wasn't like we were going like straight anywhere like we were just going on a normal path because she didn't want that it would take like she would just like do circles trying to figure out trying to like look at the landscape first which i understand i've only ever tried to take her out on a walk like one other time and that was not successful at all but this time we walked for like 10 minutes and it was good uh oh Normally I can't swallow pills anyways, but because I have a sore throat, it gets harder. <laughs> like I was having difficulties eating broccoli yesterday. That one was the biggest pill, and I think it was sideways. I have an ear infection, a throat infection, and because it's cold out, my nose is now stuffy. So far, so good, honestly. Only thing is that I kind of want to exercise, but Gio and I have like a designated time of when we'll be meeting. Clearly we can't communicate. <laughs> I can't be late. You guys like my henna? It's a little wonky donkey, but we got it for free here at the school. And I was like the last person in line. They're like, guys, like you're not guaranteed to get henna. Like you're not. And I'm like, okay, I'll still stay. Like the place closed at 11. It is 1030. There are like 15 people in front of me. I'm like, she can do this. I'm doing the math. She's like, two minutes a person? Possible. But she's mostly doing three minutes a person. I'm like, who knows? Will they physically kick me out? Will she say no? Who knows? So then when I got to her, I was just like, can you do the quickest design possible? Like, please. Because I heard the people behind me, like, they're speaking Spanish and, like, how they want something small and, like, quick. And so she did, like, just these little arrows and stuff. And then I asked for an arrow on the middle finger. That's another thing that I was thinking of searching up. Henna kits. Like, at-home henna kits. However, I would like to search up the history of henna and, like, all that stuff. To see if it's even okay to do henna at home. Someone stole my blanket. I just... I just can't comprehend why this shit keeps happening to me. I have a genuine fear that there is like a stalker or a killer who is like taking my shit, who like took my bike and now just took my fucking blanket. But that's my white hat, my white towel, my white shirt, and my big white blanket that was here. And I looked at every other washer, it's not there. Did maybe someone see me, like, put away my, my stuff and then took it? The thing is, is that they must have taken it before it actually, like, finished. Because when those type of dryers and stuff finish, it's, they say open door. The second you open the door, that notification goes away. So I think someone took my fucking blanket before it even finished drying. The blanket's not on the bed. My big white blanket is not on my bed, and I specifically remember shoving it inside the washer and then shoving it last in the dryer so someone took my blanket i can't really complain to anyone else except for you guys because i have no real form of communicating aside from perhaps my my apartment like neighbors and geo when i go see him i have no form of entertainment 
I have no form to cope with what just happened, but that's fine. Maybe someone took it because they need to be warm. And they might have seen me like put it away and they're like, oh, a nice big blanket. Notice, I didn't even notice this other thing. They took the thing that covers this, that looks like this. No one can even say that I'm crazy. You guys saw me put this in the laundry, in my laundry bag. So that was probably wrapped up with the blanket. They took both the, just, it just hasn't been a good day. It just has not been a good day. Well, I shall not dwell on it too long. And at least, I won't at least dwell on it and do nothing. I'll dwell on it while doing my laundry. Be a little bit proactive. Or productive. Y'all gonna make me do baba. Okay, what? Okay, yeah. You know some songs that I know really well? Pitch Perfect songs. Ladies of the 80s. Hey, Mickey. Hey, hey. Hey, Mickey. Hey. Oh, Mickey, you're so fine. And you're mine. I'll be yours. I can't sing very well. <laughs> my throat, I can barely sing in mass. Why won't you hit me with your best shot? ba da 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 It must have been long. But it's over day. It is over right now. <coughs> the side effects of medical marriage wanted to pull. You are cut off. Gio's here. Hi. Hey. Um, I'm clearly terrified for my life, as I mentioned to you guys before. And I wanted to buy a taser or a stun gun. And he was looking at them and he was gonna buy for, buy them for me. But then I remembered I have an Amazon gift card. However, I can't I can't use my phone. I picked up my phone and I was just like, yeah, let, let me just I'll do it. No, you can't. <laughs> I can't do shit. I gotta wait till tomorrow, which isn't a problem. Like it would probably be shipped anyways at the same time because it's like Sunday night, like past the actual business day hours. Well, but. I actually said fast delivery tomorrow. Tomorrow! Damn. Amazon, baby. Amazon! Uh. That was the first time I really genuinely picked up my phone. I was like, let me do something. Mm. Okay. I cannot. I said I said it. That nighttime's gonna be worse for me. Like, you're here, and I would want us to watch a movie when you're done studying and stuff. We can't do that. What are we going, what are we gonna to do? Read. Sit around? No, and I forgot my book. Oh my god, he forgot his book. He forgot his book. You I have my bike. I'm gonna go. I'll, I can go get it. Nah, yeah. I'll just drive you. Or, 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 I, I can tell you how to find it for free. Online. Wow. It's illegal. Hey, 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 We don't condone illegal actions here. Never. It's a safe household. It's not illegal. It's just, it's just beating the system. No. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Yeah, come on, come on. <laughs> Gio and I just finished eating dinner. He's gonna study, and I'm gonna finish reading a book I started like two months ago. <laughs> Maybe a month ago, but. Also, my bookmark accidentally ripped the page. To be or not to be? That is the question. That is a particular question. It is not morning time. It did not take me that long to fall asleep last night. I was reading my book and I just closed it and I was like, good night. That was all for this week's video. Thank you so much for watching and I bid you adieu. Au revoir, adios, and aloha. See you next time. For like any sort of entertainment. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm okay.